Hey, I'm trying to make sure my glasses are over there. So, that lives and went pretty good. I like the fact that when I just say fuck all that dumb shit that's going through my mind about not being able to get the weight and just focusing on pulling the slack out the bar and digging my feet into the floor and feeling my weight on the heels of my feet motherfucking shit goes up and now I like it. Oh. Ain't a lot of pizza. Now I'm drinking pre-workout. Well, right now it's 9.49. I need to clean all this shit out. But I'm going to do some some Romanian deadlifts which I ain't done in years. Like real years. I'm maybe four fucking years. So I'm going to work on that and then maybe get into some squats. Hopefully. We can still got the gas. Let's see. Yeah. My something. I got an idea for Matt Ogles a while back. He used to call it the food right? My only critique, I was throwing in some of these sets of squats, 145, 235, and I did 355 for a set of five with constant tension. Felt good, felt better than what I thought I was going to feel. Might be sore in the morning, but I don't know, I don't care. I'm going to go wash the dipping balls, go to sleep, wake up, bench press, go to work. Lunch pump. I don't know what else after that. But feeling good. Pulled that 545 with the chains. And want to keep this same that gun energy. You know what I'm saying? And keep moving things as fast as possible. Especially with these squats. I think that's what it was going to work for me instead of doing that. Tempo shit, which I really wasn't even doing tempo. It was just a mind fuck. And gotta get your mind right when you're out here messing with all this weight. We got what we had to do. Get the fuck about it here. Don't catch a fella. Avoid the fella. I'm gone. Yeah. Amazon. 
such a business that needs you a hundred thousand dollars per month in less. Hey, all right, lunch break. You know the dead gun vibes. Bench press real fast. Let's let's aim for a three seventy five single, and then whatever we can get after that. I'm thinking back to some pause three. 3.30 pause reps, 3 for 3. I need, I have to look at the video. I saw that when I come down with that pause, it's like I bounce off the chest and then go. So I need to let the shit settle and then go. Yeah. we we'll move it up to 40 pounds on the dumbbell rows. So yeah, the reason why I like doing the dumbbell rows that way than just a traditional pull it back because we Alright, I'm about to go and complete these next two uh, dumbbell rows on the incline. Oh, in the incline level. Mm. Yes. Good. See the 
instructions get into the bathroom. Come on. Let's go. This is when we're growing. Hey, all right, lunch pump. Ain't got that much time. But what we will do, we will achieve. And we got the Black Panther bar here, Rep Fitness bar. And we will do the bench press. And I want to get a 375. I did not get that 375 in on Wednesday. So figure, you know what, 365 on that curl, on that bow bar, that's pretty cool. I've hit 375 on that before. I think I did. Look, we'll worry about that later. We'll hit 375 with this. Let's go. single was. Um, I shouldn't have too much left to take, so 380 pounds will be pretty good for the last, or for the next few seconds. Here, and then also the, oh, the skull crunchy chair. So those are the three starts that will be restocked along with the water bottle. I can't say it. Anyway, Tina has been very integral when it comes to meat eating. You guys don't see her very often, but when it comes to... Tasty. There's no need for me to increase my protein from here and my fat levels at a middle level. So all the have to be in the front. Then it has to be good. Come if I get some meals in, check on some emails, and later on. By the way, help your child succeed in that with a Prodigy membership today. Now Five did what it was supposed to do. It went up for me. So cool. All right, let's build on that. Make sure we can get 25 pounds more, which would be a good old 405. So we're gonna keep working the daggum thing, and I will see y'all motherfuckers later. Yeah. Warm up 
process done with. We're about to start the work, the 3x5 or the 355. We're using the strength shot, bow bar, 55 pound bar, bowed out. Willie goes over quads, but I'm doing the wide stance squads. What's up, baby hitters? So, right, we're here. We still feeling the quads. We also got the jam strings. Um, yeah, sweet, Just waiting. moving. You continue to punch your safety. As well as uh, once you take apart your safety, there's a screw underneath the, the, the trigger well where you would pull out the trigger assembly if you wanted to do any work in there. So first thing we're going to do is we're going to change the safety. Now, once you've got an obscene one, some you know you've seen things where they've done way too long of an extension. This is not obscene in any way, but it's about I would say it's a good twice the, twice the distance, twice the width. So it's it. Just stick out past the pit rail. Daniel is like, see, see, I, I, I need a pep talk. Give me a pep talk. And, and I, you know, I'm going to tell you guys, the only pep talk I can give you is to put the back of the class. Oh, talk. Fuck. Hey, all right. The 3x5, the 355 is done with. We need the back downs. Clean his weight off. That's really the best thing to do when you got a home gym. I, I'm guilty of leaving my weight on the bar, but to be disciplined and really solidify your dad gum gains, you know what I'm saying? Pyramid. Go back down. So 355, took the fives and the tens off. I'm gonna do 325 for five. Take the plate off. 235 for five, take a plate off, 145 for five, then I'm gone. Legs are already juicy right now, but if I stand up, these shorts come like right here and they hug the thighs. That's what you want, you know what I'm saying, when you're trying to get the size along with the power. So, we in here for real? Come on with it, let's go. We're done, baby. The three by five and the back downs, that's all gone. Feel good, feel strong, feel swole. Time to put the truck back in, shower. Protein shake, I gotta get back on that. Like two of them a day. Sometimes I ain't even taking one and I need to up the protein in my body. None of that same amount of protein for the amount that you weigh. I need more than that. So if I can get over 208 grams of protein a day, then that's a win. So I've already took one a day. I'm gonna take another one. And whatever food that I can put in there too, probably some type of a sandwich because I'm a man and I like to be able to eat with my hands then that's what's gonna happen and take a shower call it a night wake up get these deadlifts in that's what's happening and that gummit i'm gonna see y'all tomorrow yeah hey all right that gum we are gonna get some bench press in it's late sunday not early Monday morning, but I want to pump, I want to get this work, you know what I'm saying, and I ain't trying to be on any of that weak shit right now, so we're going to overload, chain it on, and we're going to 
we'll get some sets in. Let's try to go all the way We're gonna get some sets in at uh, 325 plus your chains. Put chains on the floor, so it's not gonna be a full 50 pounds together while I'm doing 325. Um, I'll tell you this. This is a a suitcase scale. So you could take this right here and put this in. This also works on doing bands to see how much band tension you got either on the resistance or on the health. But I'm gonna take this right here. So when I press at the lockout, the lockout we should be about. So this is about thirteen. There's thirteen pounds right here. So all together, an extra twenty six pounds at the lockout. It's not a lot, but it's more than what it would be if I'm using a straight bar <clears throat> with no chains. So it's overloading and working on getting that lockout because each chain length that comes off the ground will be more pounds as I'm going up, which I said helps with the lockout. So we're going to get on this right now. Let's go ahead and start with the warm-ups. And three sets of each plate. So basically three sets of 145, three sets of two thir uh, 235. And then um, I'll probably do six sets. Six sets of three of uh, 325. Let's move. Three sets of five. Let's go. So. I said I was going to do this for, but two reps, a six by two is what we're going to do. Uh, man, I kept, I kept my ass on the mat, on the bench the whole time, but I know I have a third one in me, so six by two is going to be play.
last set, when the second rep of my ass came off the bench, that lets me know that I'm pretty much at my, I'm at my, my limit. So I'm gonna pull the chains out. So now we have 325, and I'm gonna finish the other three sets for three reps of this. Should be able to get it. Chains, 145, 235 with chains. Got three sets in of 325 with the chains. And on that third set, second rep, my ass came off the bench. I'm not with that. Took the chains off, finished with a three by three, and then did back downs. Chest feeling pumped. I love it. Dallas later on Monday with chains to go 585 one rep with chains so it's time to call it a night get back with y'all yeah oh yeah You already know what's happening when you see me over here. Getting ready for that gun deadlifts. Yeah. So get these. I'm gonna grab that's a 25 pound. If it was this 45 pound that's laying flat like that, that is so hard. Pick up. You know, get your fingers under it. And, yeah, pick it up a 45 pound plate flat off the floor. It's one of the things I always could be challenged. But, ain't tripping. The goal today is 585 with chains. One rep. Please, Lord, be with me so I can pull it. That will really boost my ego, my confidence. I've done it before. I'll do it again. So, I'm actually on lunch break right now. So, I ain't gonna have time to lie again. BS and look at my phone, just rep, add plates, rep, add plates, do set, add plates, you know what I'm saying, that's what's happening, that's what needs to happen, 
And this was gonna happen. Almost fell. Use this real quick, and then we get in. Five fifty five. Five fifty five for chains. I didn't even want to attempt the five eighty five, but I when I did when I did five oh five, I feel like five eighty five ain't gonna happen today, especially with at least the type of warm up that I did, which was no warm up. Um I, I, let me take that back. I'm uh, I used the hip circle, mostly did it while I was sitting down, lazy. And then um, between 225 and 405, I used a massage gun on my, on my hams. It's not the proper way to do things, is you should actually warm up, stretch, you know what I'm saying? But I didn't do it because I'm on a time crunch because I'm at lunch right now. However, I feel really good pulling 555 with the chains. Uh, mine wasn't where it should be, but we really got it in there the way that it was supposed to when it came time. I, I'm gonna relook at the tape, but the way that I pulled, I just had that get it past the knees type idea that if I go past the knees, I'm fucking locking it out. That's what 
I did. Blocked it out. I felt the past knees. I'm like, like I'm, I'm going, if I have to hyperextend to get this damn rep, I'm going to do that. And that gun, I got it. All right. Waiting for the UPS truck. I'm driving a little bit too fast in this neighborhood. Uh, ooh, maybe later on tonight after the Teddy Riley versus Babyface, we'll come back in here and do some do some do some sets and reps. But I'm happy with this. I'm happy with this. I'm good. All right. Let's get back here and go to work. Yeah. Hey, what's good, folks? Well, we did those deadlifts during lunchtime, and I forgot that I also need to take care of squats. So we will, this should be the last 355, 3x5 in this program. And This will be the last 355, 3x5 in this program. After I do this successfully, then we will do 375 for a 3x5. And we can grow these legs. And we want to get comfortable in the 400s. It's a coming.
check it out. Three by five. Three red lights. And the third set. Round racket. I felt the strain in my lower back. Obviously, you know what that is. Body's tired from doing deadlifts earlier today. Coming here doing these squats. <sighs> Feel like I probably didn't drink enough water. Didn't eat enough to prepare myself for all the heavy lifting that I assumed that I could do today. So, but that equals is a fail. So I won't be going up to 375 yet. I'll do 355 on Wednesday, three by five to complete it. Hope the guy that I get to complete it, then get to 375, three by five for about four days and go on from there. I'll tell you, man, it's something about lifting in, in a closed off garage. It gets humid, it gets hot, and you get sick. You get sick to your stomach. I'm sick to my stomach. Get out of breath, you know, lay down, and I lay down. Maybe I got too cold. Maybe I just, you know what I'm saying, just ain't got the gas tonight. But be smart about it. I didn't let my ego push me to get hurt, which will set me back because I've done it before, and I ain't trying to have that. I'm going to cut it short, and I'm going to come back. We're gonna win. Fuck dumb shit. Yeah.